Hi, friends. Welcome to your weekly motivational moments with Eric Vickery, president of coaching at All Star Dental Academy. And today, I want to talk to you about taking the results formula from a previous message and talk to you about growth. Now, if you're getting results, the whole point is growth, right? In fact, way back in the day, these two dudes, Plato and Socrates, debated growth versus decline. And, and they had these theories, right? They're debating. And one of them said, growth, plateau, decline. That's just the flow of things. That's how you operate. And the other said, no, 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 no. There's only two options. There is no plateau. There's just growth or decline. And so this week, I want to challenge you with understanding, first, there's only two options here. Are you growing or are you declining? And the only people that are declining are coasting. The second thing I want to point out to you is you've heard that saying, knowledge is power, right? Knowledge is power. Most of people, when I, when I ask that question at our seminars and our events, everybody's heard that saying. And then I say, is that true? And almost everybody raises their hand. They go, well, wait a second. Why would you be asking that question if it's true? Knowledge is power. Well, there wouldn't be any physicians who smoke if knowledge is power. Knowledge becomes power when you put it into action. So without action, knowledge is powerless. The second thing I want to, third thing I want to point out to you is that the definition of insanity, okay? So growth or decline, knowledge is power when it put into action, and, and this definition of insanity. Definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result. So in other words, you're getting results you don't like. So think back to the results formula, okay? The, the beliefs we have, right? The actions we take create the results in our life. We don't like the results we're getting and we're frustrated and we keep doing the same thing and we do keep doing the same thing and it drives us insane or it feels chaotic or it le leads to burnout, all of those. So if we know something, we have beliefs, but yet we don't change our actions on it, it can make you very frustrated. So my challenge for you to follow up with the previous video is what sort of knowledge are you pouring into your belief system that helps challenge your thoughts, that allows you to grow? You're either growing or declining. So and growth means new knowledge. It means new beliefs. It means new opportunities. It means changing the way you're doing things. So if you don't like the cancellations you're not getting, uh, that you're getting, you don't like the case acceptance that you're not getting, you, you don't like the results you're getting. You need to go back and look at the knowledge that you're, you're, you're utilizing and say, okay, I like that, but am I doing it? Am I putting it into action? So this week, I want you to think about something new you've learned, something new you've heard. Maybe it's something in the past that you've heard before, but you haven't put into action yet. What are you going to do differently this week to get you a different result next week? To get something you've never achieved, you need to be willing to do something you've never done before.